there, I'm here to do a review of a Japanese or Eastern style pull saw. It's a Markles uh, 9.5 inch pull saw. It's got two blades on it and it's a product of Irwin. The main difference between a uh, Eastern or Japanese pull saw and a Western push saw, the pull saw, you're actually doing the cutting motion when you're pulling back across the grain and that's when you're making the cut. With a Western saw, you're actually pushing forward to make the cut. So that main difference does two things. One, it allows you to have a much thinner blade because the blade's under tension when it's pulling back and doing the cut. It also allows you to have much smaller teeth on the saw itself. One of the benefits that was prominently displayed on the packaging is that when you're pulling on a cut, you're more likely to make a straight line, which makes sense because if you're pushing away, you're at the will of where the blade's gonna go. I spent about an hour trying this, uh, this saw out on different pieces of wood. It made nice, clean cuts. In fact, uh, uh, much nicer than a, than a Western saw if you're just looking at the quality. So in general, I, you know, I was pretty impressed with, um, with the cutting action of the pull saw side. The double-edged version also features uh, a coarser blade, which they would uh, recommend it for ripping wood. This saw kind of fell down for me when I was using that, that ripping function. You know, I may not have been doing it right, but I can tell you um, there was no intuitive way to make that uh, a clean cut. A couple other nice things about the saw, uh, it does come apart and do separate pieces. It's also good for flush cutting. Um, it's got a very flexible blade, so you can actually put this flush um, to the ground if you're cutting a piece of molding uh, around a doorway. Overall, I'd say this Japanese pull saw is great for smaller finishing cuts and uh, probably a good portion of uh, other cuts you're going to be made. Once again, this is a Marvel's 9.5 inch Japanese pull saw uh, produced by Irwin. You can find it for about 25 or 30 bucks at most big box home improvement stores, to, depending on the brand. And uh, definitely uh, worth considering for small and finishing cuts, uh, but keeping in mind, probably won't replace uh, your more traditional Western saw or even a circular saw for doing rip cuts. Bye.